All right, what's up YouTube? Back at you with another video. Like I said in yesterday's video, the video before, we got a ton of snow. Look at how much snow we got here if this camera will focus here. I gotta dig out this big pile in front of the garage just so I can get the snowmobile out, get that thing fired up, and we'll get riding today in a little bit. Yeah, we'll rip it around the lawn for a little bit and then we'll meet up with probably Justin and Ryan and uh, check out that snow fence we set up and then go hit some of the, the local trails probably. Oh man, it's literally a wall. And I'm just gonna, look, it's even got the imprints from the garage door on there. If I go, I'm just gonna slip on the concrete. It's gonna mess up the concrete if I try pushing through, but uh, I'll get the shoveling. All right, well, when he comes back to plowing a little bit, he'll be able to swoop that or I'll call Ryan. I gotta make sure this is good. I gotta add some coolant because the coolant level is a little bit low. So I mixed them up already, 50-50. Should be good. To, oh, move this bad boy up, and then we'll crank it up and get it going. If I can get my big fingers in there with gloves. All right, we're good on coolant. Boom. We got local snow. We're gonna rip around, probably meet up with Justin in a little bit. But I uh, finally got this heated shield working, if you guys didn't see the last video. But uh, yeah, should be fun. We got about two feet of snow or so. We'll go check out that snow fence, hit these uh, like snow like mounds and try and jump those. I don't know. And then we'll probably go hit the uh, some of the local trail stuff. Should be a good time. We got a decent pile right here. <laughs> Feel it! Or go up this way, go up the other way, and then go up. We're out riding. Ryan lost his heated shield cord. We had to go back and find it. Now we got a bunch of this powder. This guy wants to film for something, so he's pulled up on the side of the road. We're gonna do some flybys for him. I don't, I don't know, but we're. Uh, I don't know if you can hear Ryan right now, but try and get a few GoPro clips before the GoPro dies. trip without Ryan sled breaking literally 30 minutes in blew a belt look at that thing shot luckily these things are pretty easy to change out what would be a snowmobile riding without his sled breaking I can will and then we'll we're trying to meet up with Justin and ride with him so we'll find him in a little bit right, so it's the next day here back at it Ryan's installing a heated shield cord on his brother's sled I didn't film too much yesterday I'll try to film a little bit more today and uh, we got another probably six inches of snow last night. So uh, even more powder. And uh, we'll see what we get today. But it's so cold, it's like, it was negative. Right now it's a negative 20 real field. Yeah, it's like negative 20 real field right now. So it's pretty cold. It's hard to like get out there and hold the camera. But uh, yeah, is there plenty of room? Yeah, I think it's like five feet. But uh, yeah, I'll come back at you with probably some GoPro. And some uh, clips on here. The GoPro dies in like 15 minutes. It's so cold, so I gotta put it on, take it off over and over when I get GoPro clips. But uh, we'll make do, and I'll get a video. On. All right, so we just got out here in this deep powder. Ryan's gonna hit this big uh, like hill snow drift. I don't know what he wants right now. It's so sick. Oh. <laughs> 
That's sweet. When you come up right here, it sounds so cool. Dude, stand straight up. I know. It's all a snow drift, that it's whole thing. A big drift. We haven't even gotten down there. That'll be sick to jump those big hills. The powder turns feel so sick. I know. It's so deep. There's at least two feet right here. The can side sounds good. Yeah. The, otherwise, when the can was in the snow, it didn't look as, like, yeah. obviously it's cooler when you got the noise, but. I just smell a blowing belt. Yeah, the belt's going to blow. I take it easy every once in a while. Give it a shot now. It's so fun playing in the powder, but it's just having like just an inch and quarter track. And I just feel like I'm gonna blow about. That's the only, and I used my spare the other day when I blew about, so. Get some GoPro angles. Ugh. The echo through here is sick. It's in this like big gully, so everything it just kind of bounces off. <laughs> down for a minute we started out this morning once again pulling somebody up from the snow with the old uh, f-150 ryan's f-150 over there oh he's got it <laughs> easy <laughs> 
We're gonna cruise on a little bit more. We've been here probably like 30 minutes ripping around. Go meet up with Mike. He's gonna make us food. Shout out to Mike for that one. And then uh, we might pull him on the snowboard or something. I don't know. We'll see if he's down for that. But uh, it's so much fun out here. All right, so I'm editing this video, realized I didn't have an outro. We're definitely trying to take advantage of the snow right now the most we can. We've been riding the past like three days, so uh, because tomorrow, depending on this video, should be up Tuesday, same day I'm uh, filming this outro. Wednesday, it's supposed to be, it goes from five degrees, negative five degrees, to 43, 45 degrees tomorrow, and then right back down to like 15 degrees. It makes no sense, so um, we do have about two, two and a half, feet or so of snow but hopefully it doesn't wipe everything out it's supposed to rain a little bit but we're just trying to ride the most we can right now and have the most fun with all this powder so if you guys enjoyed it and want to see more snowmobile videos definitely let me know in the comments hit the subscribe button down below if you're new click that little bell that way you'll be notified whenever I post new videos don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Tyler Monaghan so you can see what goes down before the vlogs come out give this video a thumbs up share with your friends and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video